Siegfried Kohler was born on July 30, 1923, and died on September 12, 2017. He was a German conductor and composer of classical music. He worked as general music director of opera houses such as Hessisches Staatstheater v. Spaden and the Royal Swedish Opera. Kohler conducted premieres of works by Hans Werner Hens and Volker David Kirchner, among others, and revived rarely performed operas. He also composed music for the stage and taught at universities of music in Cologne and Saarbrücken. Born in Freiburg am Breisgau, the son of a horn player, Kohler studied harp at the Musikhochschule Freiburg. From 1942, he worked at the Theater Heilbronn as a harpist and repetitor. During World War II he was a funker, radio operator. He conducted from 1946 in Freiburg, promoted in 1952 to 1. Kapellmeister, first conductor, from 1954, he worked at the opera in Dusseldorf. From 1957, he conducted at the Cologne Opera as a conductor, later as general music director, GMD, director of music. He conducted there in 1958 the first staged performance of Hans Werner Hans's Ballet das Vokaltuch der Kammersongerin Rosa Silber, in a choreography by Lisa Kreschmar. He was also director of the operation of the Hochschule für Musik Köln. Kohler was from 1964 Gambian de Lassis in Saarbrücken and was simultaneously professor of conducting at the Hochschule für Musik Saar. The soprano in Jborg remembers that Kohler was called to the Staatsoper Stuttgart to step in to prepare Die Frau in a Schatten by Richard Strauss in 1970. Recalling that Kohler had an understanding of the breathing of the singers, from 1973 to 1988, Kohler was GMD at the Hessische Staatstheater v. Spaden. He presented unusual repertory such as Aubers die Stumm von Portisi and Wagner's Rienzi, with John Buzia in the title role, Ike Wilm Schulte as Stefano Colonna and Gail Gilmore as Adriano. He conducted a performance during the Internationale of 1979 which was recorded live with Gerd Brenneis as Rienzi, Janine Altmaier as Irene and Glenis Linus as Adriano. Kohler performed operas by Siegfried Wagner, holding days devoted to the composer twice, with concerts of Stern Angebot in 1977 and of Son in Flamen in 1979. Kohler conducted premieres of operas by Volker David Kirchner, Die Trauung, The Wedding, in 1975 and Das Kalt Hers, The Cold Heart, in 1981. He appeared as a guest conductor internationally with notable orchestras. From 1989, Kohler was chief conductor at the Royal Swedish Opera in Stockholm. He had conducted the Kungliga Hovkapell at first in 1975 and had the position of Hovkapell Master from 1992 to 2005. In Stockholm, he conducted Mozart's Die Entführung aus dem Serail, La Nazi di Figaro and Don Giovanni, Offenbach's Les Contes de Hoffmann, Franz von Sopay's Boccaccio, Verdi's Simon Bocanegra, Wagner's Der Fliegend Hollander, Lohengrin. Der Ring des Nieblingen and Parsifal, Puccini's Madama Butterfly, Electra and Arabella by Richard Strauss. He conducted concerts such as Orff's Carmina Burana and the Swedish first performance of Mozart's Il Repastor. The ballet performance used as music Rimskich Korsakov's Scheherazade. Visit Symphony in C, Arvo Parts Cantus in Memoriam Benjamin Britten and Four Last Songs by Richard Strauss. Kohler's work is documented in recordings for radio, television and records. He conducted excerpts from his own works for WERGO, with the Stotts Philharmonie Rhineland Fells and the Cornelisch Hofkapelle Stockholm. He recorded in 1993 Der Tap Fiersold at by Oscar Strauss with the WDR Sinfonia Orchester Köln and main singers Johannes Martin Kranzel as Bummeru, Caroline Stein as Nadina Popf, and John Dickey as Alexia Spiridoff. 
Kohler wrote his autobiography in 2003, with the same title as his operetta Als Capriolan. The subtitle is Ein Jahrhundert im Music Theater, a century in musical theater. He died in Wiesbaden on 12 September 2017.